He bent his head down, he ate his first meal, and then completely changed his personality from this bird that didn't like me. Now to a hunk that loves everyone and really is one of the cutest guys we have, aren't you? Well done. And that's the basic training of a bird of prey. It's very, very easy indeed. But how we get them to fly is a lot easier because they know that they get the food from the glove. So all we do is we take the glove away to a little distance to see if we can get them to jump. Now these leather straps around his legs are called jesses and we tie on there a training line for his first time out down here with us. And we stand rather close by with a little piece of food in the glove. We give him a call and they hop on for their dinner. So we send them back again. But for the next flight we extend the distance a little bit further. Slow down. Thank you. <laughs> We then send him back and we then extend the distance <laughs> a little bit further still, you seem to get the idea. And, and so on and so on and so on until now we have a hawk like this, who first of all he absolutely loves to be with everybody. Secondly, he will fly any distance to the club, but boys and girls, when I take him out for a walk, he will follow me absolutely everywhere. So boys and girls, what I'd like you to imagine now is that we're going to take a walk through the wild woodlands here of Leeds Castle. And we have Foster the Harris all flying right at the tops of the trees. The branch is bending as he sits on top, and he's scanning down with his eyesight. He's looking for his dinner. Now there's me walking underneath, and we're just beating around with a stick, whilst my tiny little spaniel dives in and out of the bracken and the brambles, when suddenly a rabbit gets up. The rabbit gets up, he runs straight through the woodland, down goes the hawk to put in chase, and catches prey with his razor-sharp talons. Now, boys and girls around the edge of the arena, would you like to see this bird catch a rabbit? Yeah! You gruesome, horrible <laughs> children. <laughs> but I need a little bit more enthusiasm. Boys and girls, would you like to see this bird catch a rabbit? Yeah! Thank you. Now, who's going to be the rabbit? <laughs> now, I need someone to come out here and give me a hand. Guys, you've got to put your hands up nice and tall. And be nice and quiet too. And we're going to have a little scan around and just see who we've got going on here this afternoon. Keep your hands up, guys. Let me have a look. We've got a couple going on down the bottom. I think that we are going to go for. Let's just put a hand down now. We are going to go for. You young lady in the pink hat just there. That's it. Come out here for me. You can leave your hat on, you probably need that. But okay, climb through the fence, young lady. Come out and say hello. Wonderful. Not the nice bit, the rabbit, but... Go on then, give a great big round of applause as she comes on out. Hello. Hello, what's your name? What's your name? Megan, wonderful. How old are you, Megan? You're six, fantastic. Are you married? <laughs> no, okay. Now, Megan, do you know why you're out here? Because you're going to be a rabbit, well done, and you're going to get chased and eaten by this bird here. Is that okay? No, okay, you won't get eaten. But you're going to be a rabbit, and we're going to show all of the rest of the boys and girls how a bird like this would catch a rabbit out in the wild. So crazy, girly. Come down here with me, and I'm going to get you teamed up with a great friend of mine, Who's hiding just down here? Okay, now Megan, because we don't want you to be eaten, we've enrolled the services of a great friend of mine who's hiding just in here. Look at this. This is Legless the Dummy Bunny Rabbit. He's a nice little teddy rabbit. He's got a bit of fur missing. He's got big smokes, but he's going to be all right. But isn't he lovely with his brown fur and a white fluffy tail? Give him a stroke. This is the loveliest rabbit in the world, Megan. You've got it good. Okay, right. So Legless is going to go all the way down there. And what I'd like you to do is hold on to this stick for me. Okay, he's not going to eat you. Okay, hold on to this stick. Lovely. Now, Megan, when I shout go, what I would like you to do is run. And run as fast as you can, holding on to the handle, dragging Legless behind you all the way over the other side of the arena. Can you do that for me? No. I, do you want to go back and see your parents? I think drop the stick on the floor and leg it really quickly. Gordon, you can go back. You go back and see your parents. Otherwise, um, we're going to end up paying out for therapy. Um, okay, young lady, don't worry about it at all. Let me have a look. We've got another four young girl. This you, young lady in the pink just over there. That's it. Can I give her a great big round of applause? Aha. Wonderful. What is your name, young lady? Bethany. 
wonderful. Great stuff, Bethany. Come and pick up this stick for me just over here. So when I shout go, what I would like you to do um, is run as fast as you can, dragging the rabbit across, diagonally across the arena. Can you do that for me? Wonderful. Just over there, in the corner, just up there. Can you do that? Wonderful. Bless her mother. Look on her face. She's going to run like the wind this afternoon. <laughs> Bethany, when I shout stop, please stop. Otherwise, you're going to drag my bird's bottom across the floor. Okay? So, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, just to show you how a bird of prey would catch their dinner out in the wild. This is a captive bred straight bird of prey. He still has his natural instincts, and this is how he can use them. Okay, Bethany. Right, you're going to give it, I'm going to give you a bit of a head start, young lady. I'm going to come and see these guys down here. Oh, who brought you here today? Who drove you here today? Your Nana. Where's Nana? Wonderful, Bethany. Wave bye-bye to Nana. <laughs> Good stuff. Okay, are you ready? Okay, Bethany, go and run as fast as you can in the wrong step. Go in the other direction, Bethany. That's it, go across the arena. In goes the bird to catch his food. Keep going. Oh. <laughs> Give them both a great big clap. Well done.